today we will be making egg rolls in the air fryer and if you're new to my channel welcome to my channel today we are going to start out with a pound of brown pork and then I'm just adding a little bit of salt and pepper I'll add the recipe down in the description if you guys want to follow along with that and then I just continued to cook up the pork I added about uh, maybe like a small size onion chopped up a teaspoon of garlic and then I always add some soy sauce while I cook up the pork And then I use this to make the pork finer pieces. It just breaks it up a little bit more just so your egg rolls have nice um, pieces in your mix. I added a can of water chestnuts. I cut them up into smaller pieces as well. You can use um, like a food processor if you want it to be finer. And then I just continue to cook that in with the garlic and onions. I added a bag of mixed coleslaw and it just like, um, I just got it from Walmart. So it's just like a mix of pretty much everything. Put a half a bag of shredded carrots and if you want that into finer pieces you can do that in your food processor as well and then I'm just adding a little bit more soy sauce we like soy sauce in our egg rolls and then just continue to mix it all together And for the secret sauce, I always put a teaspoon of peanut butter. If I'm making up a bigger batch, I usually use my wok and just uh, cook everything in there. And always a little bit more soy sauce. And this is just a bowl that it has no peanut butter in it because one of my boys can't have peanut butter. So I take out a little bit for him. And then I just get my egg roll wraps at Walmart. We usually make up like a huge batch when we do this. So we're just doing it in the air fryer this time. And then you just roll it up and I use water to seal my egg rolls. And however you want to roll up your egg rolls is just fine. I put the sides in, then I just pull it up and roll it. And then I set my air fryer to 400 to preheat for three minutes. And after your three minutes are up, you want to place your egg rolls into the air fryer, but give them space so that they can cook evenly. And then I use some cooking spray and I coat them. I set my air fryer to 400 and I will be cooking them for five minutes on one side. When they are finished, you can turn them over and then just watch your timing when you put them back in because mine were pretty much almost done. So I put a little bit more spray on them 
and then I just cook them just for like another minute or so. I didn't want to overcook them. And then I just cooked them for a little while. And they turned out really nice. So I'm just going to plate them up because my kids are going to be eating this for supper tonight. And then I just put my other batch in. And I will be cooking that at the same temp. And this time I didn't um, add any extra time, so I only cooked them for five minutes. I did not flip this batch. And this is how it turned out. Hopefully that was easy for you guys to understand. Don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.